Okay, so this is the Tomashi Nation Stage Act Trident. This is for um, anything from Tomashi Nation, so like the SH Figure Arts or the Robo Tomashi line. Or this one, I forgot what this one is. It's pretty popular online. As it shows you how it works, there's look in the direction, there's one stand, the arm, the main arm with the two attaching arms for this the back the lines the part B for the robot damashi lines because they have pegs in the back you can plug it into and part A where it turns into the hooks so you can grab it. See this is part A and this is part B. B is for like putting the um, around the figures so this shows you basically how it's just assembled so for this, you can put it up on either side. It'll feel better on the right side because it doesn't have the box window. Yeah, I got the clear version as you can see. There's the QR code for it if any of you guys want to try it. I don't know how. There we go. Clear it is. Try it if you want. This is from 2013. Here's you see here, the main baggie. It's been taped on there. There's the main stand, which is quite big. Just tape. And make sure, because it's another clamshell packaging. Don't fly off like last time, huh? There we go. So let's get the stand out. There you go. And see, you can either put this individual arms here or put it right in the center. See here, a cross shape. Two pegs here. Plug these in. That's it. The stands just pop up here. It's pretty low, but then you can add in the arms up here. Let's take a look at the back show you. So, yeah, you can use the secondary arms to put in the front, and you can use these joints up here. First, let me check out which version this is. Okay, so these are the top, and these are for the bottom. So the short ones I just grabbed for the bottom. And then you can put the rods in here pretty easily. It's always weird to get the one with the ends up. These 
long edges go downwards. And you're what you're hearing in the background is Family Guy. And so, now those just be fine by itself, it's just to use for Robot Damashi, but since we're using ACH figure arts, we would have to use the company stands along with it. So let's add these in. So these are easy to get off. All right, so give me a minute to find the clipper to try that. In these situations, I would normally use like my Gundam kits to um, actually get it off the um, stands, but it's very late at night, so I'm going to use these oversized nail clippers for those. And it just does the job fine, but if you want more, less, um, these marks that I'll probably knife off with my hobby knife later. Put this one upside down. I realized. It's on quickly. This one's done correctly. Yeah, so on my previous Gundam builds, you have seen me using um, the trimmer, like what you use for the dead skin right here at the edge of the cuticles for it but I do not have those available right now. But I will have those out for um, my next Gundam reviews because I have quite a few to you. stand here. And then you have like really weird stuff like normally you would put these around the chest because that's where they would pivot very well. Gavin at an angle uh, decayed. This is the violent emotion version down here. And then you would have Kuga down here. So then you could have it where if you position them just right and have Kuga and Gavin type G attack evil decayed basically that's who he is it's right here 
And Gavin should be easier because he doesn't have any die cast on him. But because he's lighter, it's more difficult to get a hold on him. So you could have something like this happen. You could remake like a superhero Tyson movie scene. Or this stage, trying stage, would be good um, with the um, the the Tamashi SH Figure Arts exclusive um, set, the Cyclone Cyclone and Joker Joker. So you can have the this set reversed. So then these two be in the front and the main one be in the back. And you have DK the kid with Cyclone Cyclone and Joker Joker using his final form ride to split them apart. Which is pretty awesome. And you can replace the kid with Cyclone Joker so you can show him in the back turning into the Cyclone Cyclone and Joker Joker in the back. Basically you can have these up to three if you want. You don't have to use all three stages. Use one down here if you want it more grounded. You can use one, two, or three. It doesn't really matter because it's the main stage. But it's really up to you and how you want to pose your figures. So this is Mofo See That and I hope you enjoyed this review and check out my other videos. See you guys later.